How's it going, guys? Tax HD here, bringing episode 19 of my NHL 15 Hawk Club the Team or Glory series. Sorry, guys, for making it wait another week. I'm supposed to have like two or three of these out a week. Just I've uh, been busy with all the other videos, but from now on, guys, expect two to three or Glory episodes out every single week. I'm going to try and, uh, you know, stay on that schedule of two to three. But anyway, guys, in our first game here, you guys can see tying it up there with a goal from Helm, making it 1 1. Still in the first period here, we're actually going to go down. 2-1, so uh, we kind of make the comeback again, uh, what we're used to, and as you can see, second slot, he puts another one in at the, late, uh, the end of the first period, they're making it 3-1, so not the best uh, end of the first period, luckily right there, Spezza snipes one, beginning the second, but gets us back in it, making it 3-2, unfortunately, he's going to put another one in there at the beginning of the third, making it a 4-2 game, that was actually the final score, so uh, pretty close game there, even though we lost by two, bit of a collapse at the end of the first period, uh, if we didn't have that, definitely would have been a much closer game, maybe forced an OT, but this is actually the first game of our season, uh, sorry, sorry not season, but our Division 4 guys, so if we uh, can get promoted here, it'll actually be in Division 3, right there guys, you might have seen, I actually got a St. Louis, uh, I was when I was streaming, someone wanted to give it to me, they were quite persistent, so I did oblige, I did accept it, as well guys, right here are the uh, cards I sold from the New Jersey collection, I've actually already done those that pack will be, and if you guys missed it, just check out the Road Glory playlist, uh, it'll be in there. But uh, anyway guys, uh, after selling all that, you guys can see I only have like 25k, I had to do that 90k giveaway for the 1000 video, and I think I gave away another giveaway, so uh, we're a little bit short on coins here, but luckily right here we got a pretty good offer, Steve Mason and Camelot from Yemi, not sure if that person uh, was like knew who I was or not, because Mason alone goes for more than Yemi, and then Camelot on top, so basically I ended up making like I think 2k off of that trade, so really solid deal. Over here guys you can see it actually on all my lineup, it's pretty similar to what you've seen before, except you might notice I have Taylor Hall there on the first line left wing, it's actually not my Taylor Hall, I'm actually borrowing him from Hutpuck Traders, if you guys don't know him, uh, most reliable way to get coins in HL15, link's always in the description, check him out guys, uh, just 100% legit, and he's letting me borrow Hall just for basically as long as I want pretty much to try him out, see how he plays, he knows he's one of my favorite players, so he's pretty, basically just doing me a huge favor. Anyway guys, right here on our next game, trying to get the win here as we don't want to start 0-2. He's going to snipe one though, making it 1-0. Luckily though, right here, we're able to pass it out front, find McKinnon in the back door there, making it 1-1 half through the second period. Then right here, Erickson finding Kabrick, making it 2-1, still in the second there. Now in the third period, 5 minutes in, he's going to tie it up with Ekman Larson on his power play. A bit of a fluky goal there, just bounces off of letting it end in, making it 2-2. And then right here, a little bit later, he's going to actually get the lead 3-2 half through the third period here. And that was actually the final score of the game. So that one was kind of rough. We had the you know one goal lead there and a couple goals there in the third period gives him the win. So two glo close games there, two rough losses, but uh, luckily still a lot of games left here in this season. So definitely still have a chance of promotion, even though we're 0-2. So after that, guys, just went right back in another game, uh, trying to get our first win of this season. Obviously, the 0-2 start was not what we were looking forward to at all. Going up against uh, USA Americans, this team name is. And uh, right here, halfway through the first period, he's going to open up the scoring. Just the backhander there with, I think, St. Louis. Uh, making it, or I think that was actually Blake Wheeler's story. Making it one nothing. Then right there, we tied up with Taylor Hall. Making it 1-1, still in the first period. Then right here, guys, McKinnon just going to take this puck, snipe it, and then Hall with the tip. Such a sick tip that actually counted. I was pretty surprised. Made it 2-1. Then right there, Petrangelo just claps one in the back of the net. Making it 3-1. Started coming away with this one. Tarasenko on the breakaway. Half of the third period there. No mistake. Six Sully Makes it 4-1. And then right there, uh, Kucherov's going to walk out front of the net. Put one in there for us. Making it 5-1. So a big win there. And to get us rolling. We're now 1-2 and two on the season. So hopefully we can keep this, uh, you know, winning streak alive. We got seven games left. So still, you know, definitely have a chance at the, the Division Three promotion here. But, you know, we got our work cut out for us for sure. Also, so he ended up putting another goal late, guys, but it was already 5-1, so didn't really think it mattered. Didn't need it, including. Uh, anyway, guys, next game here, we're going up against uh, Triple O, Moran, Triple O, and we're getting the first period there. Kropitar is actually going to snipe one, just squeaks by his goalie, makes it 1-0. Then the second, second period here, no score until here, but as you can see, he puts one in there on the power play. Tied up at one apiece. Then right here, Kopitar on the puck again. Fans on it, but Hall's uh, there to bury in the loose puck, making it 2-1. Right here, though, he's going to answer back. Tied up at two apiece with a breakaway goal there. So 2-2 two, two, two here, but luckily right here, Hall again on the breakaway. 5-3, on no mistake there. Super clutch. Gets the goal uh, and gives us a 3-2 lead. Then right here, Hall on the puck again between that defender. Ends up taking it back here, looking for the snipe. Just absolutely smashes it right in front of the goalie. Makes it a 4-2 game. So Hall was a hat hat trick in that game and a big reason we won and right here guys you can see just run away with this one Kopitar splits the D and finishes it off with a goal 30 seconds left just to absolutely demolish this guy add a little bit of insult injury there making it the 5-2 win big game from Hall as well put the hat trick in so uh really good game there uh with the 2-2 win so after that guys we're going right back into another game here and um as you guys can see we're actually going up against let me see here it was a little late uh 
Bar Bar Mars, I believe his name is. So uh, we're two and two now in the season, so not bad. We're looking for another win here. Like I said, keep the streak going. Unfortunately, right there, he's gonna get a gold Mike Richards just off the tip there, making it one nothing. Luckily though, Helm too fast to cover, just goes around the net for the wraparound, making it one one. That was late in the third, forcing it overtime. No goals there. Go to the shootout. Unfortunately, right there, had to score with Spezza to keep it alive, and I missed it. So shootout luck, still not the greatest, but luckily we did get one point there, which is a lot better than none. So uh, two two and one now. So pretty much exactly five hundred after five games. So uh, that if we stay two two and one, that won't give us the promotion. We have to win a little bit more games here in the second half of this season. But here, guys, we're going up against Zerbio nineteen. I believe you say his name, and uh, McKinn there always on the back door puts that one in, giving us the one goal lead early in that game, less than a minute in. Then right here, guys, five minutes later, uh, Gabrick tries to score there, fans on it, but uh, luckily Spezza was there to put it in, making it two nothing. Then right there, Bozak's just going to walk up front late in the third, giving us the uh, three goal win and solidifying uh, the W. So. Big win there, guys. We're now seven points, so definitely staying in Division Four, and we're now four points away uh, from the Division uh, Division Three. So we have to win two of our next four games, which isn't too tough, but obviously you never know who you're gonna get matched up with. So uh, right here, guys, we're going up against Chewbacca's. Uh, that's his team name, at least. I didn't see his actual name. And uh, right here, guys, half through the first period, he gets a breakaway. He gets the goal. Uh, not gonna mess that one. So town again. Uh, no scoring in the second period. Finds in the third, though. He puts another one in, making it two nothing. So. Not how we wanted to start, and actually that was the final score of the game. So uh, definitely not what we were looking for. We have three games left. Need to win two of the next three. So definitely gonna be tougher for us than it was before this game. And it's actually a pretty close game. You guys can see their shots, time attack, everything. Just uh, two bad breakaways. Really, I shouldn't have let him have. Uh, otherwise, that was a really close game. Uh, most likely headed to overtime. Then a shootout. Bray here, guys. Go up against Blue Haze, six four fifty eight. Definitely need this win. He's gonna get the first goal um, on our on our power play. Actually, on his penalty kill, makes it one nothing. Then dying seconds, he puts another one in there with Johansson, making it two nothing. So uh, we got a long way here to come back. Luckily, Kopitar out front there just puts in a nice backhander. Dying seconds of the second, making it two one. Then right here, twenty five seconds left in the third. Come back alive. Cabrick smashes that one in the back of the net. That one was so close, down two, uh, two goals there, late in the second and late in the third to tie it up. Unfortunately, though, he gets the OT winner, but luckily this does uh, allow us to actually keep our uh, Division three hopes alive as we got the one point there. So uh, definitely needed that point. Unfortunately, you know, didn't get all two points, so it made it much easier. So after that point there, guys, we have two games left. Need to get at least one win and one overtime loss. So it's going to be close. And right here going up against... Big Voss V1, so uh, we definitely want to get a win here, set us up for the next game. Right there, Erickson snipes one, uh, beginning the first period. I was actually streaming during this, guys, and I was saying I hope he just quits, because I think it was getting late, and I wanted to just finish off these two games. And as you can see, one goal in, he quit. So, I mean, that worked out pretty perfectly. Uh, I called it, too. I don't know why he quit. He was only down one uh, first period. I guess he was just uh, completely fed up. So, anyway, guys, uh, next game here. We only need one point, one game, one point. So, it's pretty much all on the line. Going up against Bad Boy, one, two, three, four, five. So, I wasn't sure how good this guy was, but I was really hoping he wasn't the best as, you know, clutch game here, or crucial game, I should say. Luckily, Helm again just walks out from behind the net, makes it one nothing. The McKinnon there snipes one for us from out front, making it 2 nothing. So, looking good so far, unfortunately. Right here, he gets a closer game. Snipes one there, making it 2 1. Still in the first period, though. And then, right here, you guys can see uh, Taylor Hall just unreal in this entire uh, season. Makes it 3 1 for us. Then, right here, Helm's going to win it to Airhoff. He slaps one there from the point, making it 4 1. Then, right here, guys. Uh, Jared Allen on the puck, just gonna find Helm there, making it 5-1, so we're starting to come away with this one, as you can see, Hall again, just gonna get the breakaway, he's too fast to cover, obviously he's gonna put that one in, makes it 6-1, and we weren't quite done there yet, again, uh, right here, Spets on the puck, just gonna backhand that one, I think Kane got the tip, making it 7-1, so big, big win there, uh, that we definitely needed, this gives us the Division 3 promotion, so, uh, big win there, but obviously we're gonna have our work cut out for us in Division 3 if we just squeaked in, so we'll see what happens in the next episode, guys, or the next, next episode uh in division three the next episode guys will actually be a pack opening episode if you guys want that tomorrow uh make sure to like this video if we get 200 likes guys uh that pack opening episode will be out tomorrow as well guys we just want to show you the stats of both kopitar and hall this is their first you know season kopitar nine points nine games hall 11 points 12 games with seven goals so just unreal those two on the top line anyway guys that's it for this episode if you guys enjoyed it please leave a like thank you for watching guys have a nice day goodbye You're gone